All right, so today, guys, we're going to be installing the final part of the build, the power supply. Uh, now, when you install this part, you want to make sure you do it correctly and efficiently so that when you actually turn on your PC, it actually turns on the first time. And a lot of people make mistakes in this part, so make sure you follow it step by step like I teach you. And um, if I teach you something or you learn something new, uh, make sure you like and subscribe and I will be giving more tutorials and CP analysis in the next video. And let's get into it, all right? Now, your power supply should come with um, these screws. Um, and these screws are how you, well, literally screw it into um, into the back, back here. So let's do that. Make sure your fan when you plug it, in, when you um go to put your power supply in, make sure your fan is facing downward towards the ground. Because if it's not facing down towards the ground, then um you're going to choke off your power supply, and you do not want to do that. So make sure it's facing down like so. All right, now when it comes to screwing these in, they're not that difficult. Uh, this screw right here is usually the most difficult, I'd say. Um, but so when you go to screw it in, make sure you do opposite sides first. It's just that much like easier to just screw in ourselves, you know? You can probably just see I use your thumb a little bit. And then screw it in. All right. Now, let's do the fun part. Okay. Now you have all of these wires. <laughs> all of these wires. So, what do you connect them to? All right. We're going to show you. <laughs> All right, now let's first start off by getting these over here. And then this one. Okay. All right, so let's start with this. Now, what we want to put on this is basically a um, SATA power port. And that would be one that looks like this. Perfect. So you want to put a SATA power cord that looks like this and connect it to your fan hub if you, that's if you have a fan hub. Boom. All right. The, another SATA port, this is just like a mess of wires to be honest. But yeah, we want to connect another one to the SSD. The L is lined up where it's supposed to be. And usually it should be like this where the L is like, um, the L is like sideways almost. Let me put it on. Just like that. <laughs> Took me a little bit, but it worked. So that's in, that's in. Um, okay. Now, you want the big guy to route through here. The 24, 24 one. You want him to route through here. Okay. 
This is just the cable management is just ridiculous. Modular power supplies are the way to go, guys. Don't. This is just le a lesson, like, as to, like, you see all these cables, like, oh my gosh. It's just so brutal. So please, make sure you connect everything. Or, well, not everything, but make sure that um, when you put everything in, that uh, your cables are all right, because this is just going to be a mess, all right? All right, so let's put this through here. All right, so when it comes to connecting your 24 pin, I wrapped it around and you see I could I put it right here. Um, that's exactly where you want to go up here. So those are labeled CPU right here. I will show you. I'm on modular power supplies, they probably won't be labeled, but you see it says CPU. So this one goes right in here. Because there's two, there's a eight volt at the top that we want to use. Or right, at the top. <clears throat> Little hard to get in, but. And to do that, break off piece, it's it's really ugly. I have to figure out how to fix the, the GP. I really don't like it. That's 8.2. I, I don't, um, if you have zip ties on hand, Flip side down. Done. But okay, now that you have that done, you can uh, rear panel. <clears throat> now you might want to cable manage because like. This is like brutal, but this is the finished product. Um, as you can see, I have everything set up. All the filters I plugged in. Um, some of the this this is for my microphone for my headset um but other than that i plugged in everything and um i'll give you guys a quick you know, quick a quick peek of inside um i put on the front panel as well and the back panel is also on as you can see um but yeah Take a peek inside. Everything is all set up. Good to go. Ready for action. The motherboard, the motherboard, every everything's just ready to go. Yeah, like as you can see, uh, uh I, I kinda wanna show, okay. So yeah, this is everything plugged in. This is everything set up. Um, you see inside of the power supply very quick if you want but this is a bag i haven't plugged in my ethernet yet but um i'm going to but yeah this is the build guys this is this is basically the entire pc all put together all right now now that i'm done this 
I'm going to actually post a video of how to like turn it on, um, the procedures you do for making sure the motherboard is working and everything, making sure everything is um, turned on correctly and make sure like it actually posts. So I'm gonna see if it posts in the next video. And if it does, um, they're gonna do a tutorial on the XMP profiles, on how you wanna set it up, if you wanna overclock what you do and all that good stuff. So, all right. See you guys in the next one and make sure you like and subscribe for more. Thanks.